Today, an Australian company is on the verge of a game-changing breakthrough that would enable large amounts of silicon to be introduced into the graphite anode of lithium-ion batteries. Tesla, at its recent battery day, announced that the required step change to increase lithium-ion battery energy density and reduce costs is more silicon in battery anodes. For this to be achieved, high energy capacity metallurgical silicon needs to be introduced into anode chemistry as silicon has 10 times the energy retention capacity compared to the incumbent anode material graphite. In the words of Elon Musk, this is the most promising anode material. However, metallurgical silicon isn't currently used in lithium-ion batteries due to two major technological challenges. Silicon expands up to 300% in volume during battery operation, causing swelling, fracturing and battery failure. The second challenge is that silicon deactivates up to 50% of the lithium ions in a battery. Called first cycle loss, lithium ions are rendered inactive by the silicon, immediately reducing battery performance and life. The industry is in a race to resolve these technical challenges as the prize for the first to succeed is barely imaginable. This Australian company believes its nanotechnology that delivers an alumina coating of silicon particles will resolve both the swelling and first cycle loss capacity problems. Research and development conducted by the company has shown very promising results. Initial battery testing was encouraging and further tests are ongoing. The company is rapidly gaining confidence in its game-changing alumina coating technology. This company has already commenced a pre-feasibility study for the construction of a 10,000 tonnes per annum battery materials coating plant in Saxony, Germany to service the burgeoning European lithium-ion battery market.